mental strength, which is what I think is your great gift, is much harder to articulate. Can you I would have to correct explain? you. I would have to yeah, correct I you. It's correct not a gift. You. It's something that you have to produce, you have to create. It's something that comes with work. Novak is right. Mental strength comes from putting in the work. You can't just read a book, you can't just consult a sports psychologist, and you can't just journal your thoughts. Mental strength comes from training. And at Two Minds, we developed exactly the kind of training programs that Novak is talking about. Step by step, training your mind like you would train your body with actual workouts that overload. And if you're curious about how that works, come and visit us at twominds.com. Now in this video, I would like to address one more interesting thing about the video at 60 Minutes um, in which Novak was featured. And they are talking about mental strength. And I think that that term is unfortunate. Or it's unfortunate that that term is seen as what we should be going after. And I would like to take a step back and look at physical fitness, right? Where when we say physical strength, we realize that physical strength is just a small part of physical fitness. There's much more to physical fitness and that's well accepted, right? Sure, there's strength or maximum strength, but there is endurance, there is mobility, flexibility, there is explosivity, there's balance, why are we just talking about mental strength? We should be talking about mental fitness and we should be recognizing that mental strength is just a part of it, right? Strength and resilience are the buzzwords. But what about being smart? What about being nimble? What about the ability to be balanced and calm? That's something else than resilience or strength or grittiness. So looking at mental fitness in a much more granular way is something that we should be going after. And it's not really the paradigm or culture yet. But I would like to invite you to come and visit us at twominds.com and see how we approach that in a very systematic way. I hope to see you on our platform.